Hey, what's happening, YouTube friends? Today I got a little request to show you on this Honda 300 four tracks foreman. I want to show you what top dead center is on these motors when it's going time to uh, set your cam. Now I know I don't have the head on the motor. I left it off just for this illustration. And this is the four wheel drive version of the Honda. They make it in two wheel drive. Your two wheel drives will have a welch plug right here that you can take out to turn the crankshaft with. The four wheel drives you can't because you have your cross connect right here. You can't get to it. So on your starter cover, the way you can do it is you take a, right here in my hand is a T, T20. And right inside on the starter cover, you can see right there, you can put your T20 in here, okay? Just like so. And then what that'll do, you can turn it counterclockwise. And when you do that, that's gonna roll your crank. You see a piston going down, okay? You can roll this motor completely over by turning this by hand if you're wondering how to do it on the four wheel drive version. So, when you get close to top dead center, top dead center is when the piston is at the very top of the cylinder and it's fixing to go back down. I don't know if you can really see it here. Try to focus. But there is a F mark and then a T mark. F mark is when it's gonna fire. And the T mark is when you are at top dead center. There's a T mark on the flywheel. And right there, I know it is hard to see but there is a T mark there and it lines up with the mark on the case. So if you look, now your piston is at top dead center. And that is when you go to set your camshaft, what top dead center is. It means your piston is at the very top of the cylinder. Of the, of the cylinder. All right, guys, any questions, let me know. I'll make another video Show them we set the uh, cam and uh, the timing on it. We're having the valves worked right now, so the head's in the shop. Anyway, this is a little Honda 300. It's a, you know, pretty big bike for what it is. But it's a, I believe a 93. It needed a top end this time. It's drank a lot of water, so. Anyway guys, that's just how we do it. That's how just to show you how to roll your motor around to get your top dead center when you go to set your cam. Next video I'll show you when we set the camshaft at top dead center and time it. Thanks guys, have a good one. Well, this is no good. We have two bent valves. You watch when I turn it in the intake valve. See all that wobble? That's yeah, no good, can't have that. It will never seat properly in the valve seat in the head. And the exhaust side, it's got a big bend in it too. That's no good, way no good. That'll never work. So here's the intake again. See the wobble in it? That's not gonna work. Need to need.